pretty exciting win, you know, for the team. Obviously, for Jake, uh, he was very impressive to say the least. Uh, probably the most impressive thing was the way he came out of the gate, and and you could tell he was amped and probably throwing some balls, you know, up in the zone. That just his um, energy, anxiety, whatever you want to call it, was not helping. But he was able to correct a lot of those issues really quick for a young pitcher in that type of atmosphere. Uh, we needed a win and, 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 you know, ultimately or generally you don't talk to, you don't ask for a guy to come up and make his debut to provide that, but it worked out. He was just outstanding for us. And then uh, not a ton of hitting going around, but, but uh, Tim Beckham, you know, came up. Uh, we got the big hit with the guys on base. I know we've left some guys on base lately. Beck had a tremendous at bat where he fouled off a bunch of fastballs, appeared to be in. Uh, Puffer was running sinkers, and, and Beck kept fighting and then just shot a ball the other way. But, uh, you know, story of the night. It's Jake, Faria, and, and, then, and then Beck's big hit. What was it that allowed him to be so effective tonight, Faria? You know, I think, uh, well, I mean, the way he, he just threw strikes overall, uh, that was the biggest thing that he showed zero fear of attacking and getting outs within the zone. And that, that's a big ask for a young guy to come in and, and come get some of these hitters out. But you got to prove and establish that you'll, you're willing to get them out in the zone, not looking for a chase every single time they're going to swing. Uh, and he did that. And then, you know, he threw some really good change-ups. He threw some great change-ups earlier in the count. And then he threw some, some nasty ones to get a couple punch-outs with. But I, I was just generally over – you know, really impressed with the fastball command and not altering his approach uh, because he's at a different level now. I mean, that's kind of what he's been all year in Durham. What's it like for you? I mean, you've had a lot of call-ups this season, but specifically for tonight to see him go out in front of his friends and family and get the job done. Look, it's exciting for, for all of us in the dugout, uh, especially when you get to know some of these guys a little bit in spring training, then you don't see them. And all you do is kind of catch up from the, the AAA coaches and staff on, on how they're doing and, you know, then, then they're here. So it's exciting. You want to see all the guys get called up and have success. Uh, no doubt uh, tonight was, was special because we felt there was a need. We needed to give some guys, some of our starters, some, a rest. And, uh, you know, he, he provided just a huge boost for us. How was he before the game? Did you notice him in the clubhouse or anything? Did you talk to him before? I, no, I didn't talk to him at all. I don't even know if I saw him before the game. I, generally, I don't converse too much with a starting pitcher for that day. Did you just take a peek to see how the kid was acting before no. the debut? No. Nice to see the bullpen shut it down too at the end. Yeah. Tommy came in, uh, picked up Jake that inning right there, made some big pitches. And then, uh, you know, Alvarado, that might might have been his best strike throwing outing where he was just in the zone the entire time. And I think, you know, we all see when, he, when he's in the zone, his stuff definitely plays. I mean, there's a big difference between being, uh, you know, 1-0 or 0-1 or 2-0 or 0-2 in this league, and I think Jose's figuring that out. And then for Alex, you know, Alex does what he always did, you know, comes in, falls behind, probably because of just a lack of work over there. I think he's pitched once in the last week, but uh, quickly found his groove and, and made some big pitches. Beyond it being exciting to see the rookie go out there and get that big win, how big is this win going forward, you know, to get – in that skid after what happened in Seattle. Yeah, we, we, we needed a win for sure. Yesterday, uh, you know, the, the Seattle series was tough. We got beat in Seattle. Uh, we just got outplayed. Last night was frustrating that we had opportunities and, and it kind of smacked us right in the face. So that, that was frustrating last night. Not, I mean, losses are losses, but we needed to bounce back and, and you know, a, a huge night by Jake Faria and then a huge at bat from Tim Beckham.